morning. Well, the miserable, miserable winter days have meant that the eco flow is running pretty low every day. So now I'm having to get a little generator to charge the eco flow to power everything else. It's the most un eco eco flow there is, I think. But I've got an electrician coming today who's hopefully going to get the proper electric connection here. That is really difficult to drill through them, which I guess is a good thing, but these sections are a lot thicker than the I-beams that I was putting up. Now that is a drill bit. So I wanted to drill the holes after the beam went up because I wanted to make sure they fell on the stone, not on the mortar joint, so they were the most secure they can be. Well, that's the first one done. It's taken quite a while, actually. It's in a good 40 centimeters deep. So I've got another four of them to do. I don't know if that's gonna to be today or not. Oh, by the way, the meeting with the electrician went really well. Um, he's going to speak to the electric company and try to get us a temporary supply to the gate of the chateau as soon as France will allow. So while I'm waiting for the torrent to calm down, I wanted to update you on a few things since I forgot to go back to it when we're clearing out the basement. So you might remember me mentioning that there was a very good reason why this floor was a dirt floor compared to all the other floors in the basement, which are either printed concrete or tiles. So here's what we now know. We now have pieced together the fact that the basement in the 80s by the new owners, the Murignyes, were, this basement was the first thing they were concentrating on. So they started by concrete in inside and outside all the walls. We, uh, I've been spending a bit of time taking it off now because we now know it's the wrong thing, but it's very much a fashion back then for easily waterproofing something. All the stamped concrete was actually done at the same time. And that kind of proves why it's in such good condition, you know, bizarrely good condition. That was done at the same time. The laundry basins were put in at the same time as that. And the room behind me had planning permission for a swimming pool, an in-ground swimming pool. Now, obviously, they got everything done bar that. They must be waiting to dig or something, and then Chateau caught fire. It never happened. I don't think I'll go with the swimming pool idea now, but it's just cool to know this, you know, and stuff is starting to make more and more sense in the Chateau now.
God, that's hard work. All two. Whew. Well, the good thing is, at least I know I've rebuilt this properly because there's no easy spot to drill here. It's packed full of granite, which is what I wanted, but with just like a little tiny bit of, of mortar, but yeah, anyway, two down. I think I'm gonna call it a day. Look, this is what I think we'll do. Give me a day or two to just crack on with this without having to worry about filming it and getting the camera wet. Let me get it done, because this is so important for, well, stopping this out. Couple of days, and I'll see you Sunday. Yeah, all right. I'll see you Sunday.